So who am I speaking with? Fabian Gordon, CTO of Ignite Technologies. And uh, Fabian, uh, we had spoken uh, before about uh, one of your products, the uh, live product, but you also have a portal product. Uh, usually weren't you using, just going through companies' portals, like their pre-existing portals, why your own portal? Yeah, that's true. Uh, you know, what we've done in, in the past years is, is help companies integrate our content delivery system and our, you know, peer assisted push and all that uh, through their existing portals. A lot of companies have come to us and say, hey, we don't really have a portal. We like your technology. We, we look, we're going to keep using it, but we'd really like a, a front end to it that's more YouTube-like or portal-like and allows us to do things like comments and ratings and, and those kind of social media uh, type aspects that, that people have really become accustomed to on the consumer side of the world, i.e. YouTube. Uh, so that's what we've Built. We essentially built a portal engine that integrates very tightly with your existing security model, your Active Directory, or whatever it is that you're using, and leverages our system or not. Uh, you know that's one of the new features of the portal where you can have uh, users uh, that already have our client installed, but you can also have users that don't. Uh, so when you need to reach other platforms that perhaps can't run our product, or you need to reach mobile users or users that aren't actually part of your network and you want to reach people off-site, the portal product allows you to kind of fill in the gaps there and and, and meet that. You know the the, the night motto of you know content everywhere anytime uh, the portal helps us get to that last you know few people that uh, we could never get to and provides a nice organizational structure for that content that users are kind of familiar with if they need a portal type experience um, is that portal integrating also with their and essentially you mentioned active directory but is that it integrating with things like SharePoint and other uh, applications like that yeah, actually our, our player, our embedded player already integrates into SharePoint or any other portal for that matter. Uh, there's there's no native backend integration as yet. That's actually something that uh, that we're discussing at this point, whether or not to do and whether which version, of course, of SharePoint we're going to do that on because we're, we're, we're seeing a change there in the architecture as well. Uh, but in terms of embedding, you know, Ignite delivered content, whether it's video or any other type of content that Ignite delivers, that can already be done using our embedded player. Excellent. And uh, again, you're in beta, so what are you learning you know, from your beta test users from the portal? I mean, what have you tweaked? What have you taken out? What have you added? Well, we, what we've learned is that simple works. Uh, simple is something people can understand. Uh, and and, and the, the hard part in anything like this, taking something as complex as what we're doing uh, and, and, and really boiling it down to uh, user interfaces and management interfaces that make it real simple for anyone to run the system. And in the case of the portal, uh, end users can also be publishers of content too, so that opens up, uh, you know, for us at least, a new, a new type of publisher that we've not re really had to deal with much before. Excellent. Fabian, thanks so much for your time. Thank you very much, David.